Huh? That was... peculiar. Give me a minute. Surely there's a guide somewhere on how to fix this. Aha! Check this out. How to fix common issues with cat DOS. To fix your SL model cat DOS, you just have to think outside the box. To do so, I've made an example just for you. Let's pretend that you're on the main menu and you need an error report to get to the root of your troubles. To do so, you simply just type in the serial number located on the right-hand side of your cat DOS SL. Or, as I do, type in the admin command that works for these older models. I personally hate this model as it's stuck with the same firmware, despite all of the technical issues it faces. I could probably make a better version system in half a year, but alas, here we are. Now that the code is typed, we can go to the gallery to receive our error report. I will leave the error report that I received in the description of this video, as this specific error is quite common. Next time, I'll show you an example of how to use your CatDOS SL's terminal to manipulate its user data. How to manipulate user data in CAT DOS. To manipulate your data, you just have to think outside the box. To do so, I've made an example just for you. Let's pretend that you have a heart, and with this heart, you have a file. Imagine taking that heart and putting it in a place most familiar. Now, use your heart to reach a command prompt. It is quite hard to reach, which is another reason why this software is among my least favorite.
with a spooky. <laughs> Sorry, I was just trying to light up the mood with how bad you're playing. This motherfucker, this motherfucker, this motherfucker. 